step one, we have our CentOS 8 machine. I already installed it. Clean install. To show you what I have set up, JDK is configured. I'm running as root here, just to make things easy. And SE Linux should be disabled. You can always verify that by checking out the config. So it is disabled. UMask, uh, I could set for this environment, but it's going to be configured anyway and set on the fly during the install process, as I'll show you later on. Right now, where I'm at, I have a Luna client, the Universal Client 10.2 installed. This will act as our root of trust uh, client to perform the NTLS connection. And I am going to run through the install now. We'll use the default directory, which would be a USR SafeNet Luna client. Not going to change anything there. What do we need installed? I'm connecting to a Luna 7 password HSM. So we need network HSM uh, product line. That's it for this. What else? We have uh, several components like the SDK and FM. In this case, we need the JCProv. Uh, component installed so that's the p11 uh, api wrapper that we're going to use and actually ccc's application uses on the back end so we'll install great so that is installed now if i go to the default location We see we have the JCProv configured and Luna CM is working. I just have no slots and no partitions configured yet. So in the next step, I'm going to go through how to set up and initialize the root of trust. Now, we're not going to use it yet until probably the very end, but we need to get it set up in the back end first.